After four weeks, the Halloween event is finally here with so much stuff to check out, and we got it all covered. We got the new Halloween event right here, which, I mean, we might as well enter because this is the whole point of the updates. And here we are. Oh, my God. It is with areas that we have to go through. But there is this quest system over here where if I do actually complete this, I can earn this hoverboard as well as this, um, or wait, this hoverboard and this booth. But look, bro, they got Halloween candy currency in here. Yo, this is all the way from, like, the first Halloween event Petsim X ever had. They are bringing it back, bro. And as you can see, we do have the quest right on the side of our screen. Plus, they do give us candy for beating it. So, we might as well go ahead and complete it. There we go. I just did it in, like, one click, bro. Now, I need to collect 50 candy corn. What the heck is candy corn? But, oh, my God. Of course, they had to add more stuff into the exclusive shop, man. They have a spider pack with a Titanic Dominus Darkwing, which is flyable. And, by the way, this is limited only for this month. So, this Titanic and huge Dominus Darkwing are going to be going away. There is also other stuff inside the exclusive egg, which I want to check out. And what just happened, bro? Alright, bro. I have no idea what they just did, but we're back in here. And as you can see, bro, so in this act, there's like literally no pets. The only purpose of it is for your quest. And I mean, trying to get better stat pets, I guess. Because remember, event worlds, you have to actually hatch the eggs to be able to break stuff a lot faster. Because the stat pets in here are way better. But here we go. Let's get area two because we can just get it. All right, we need to make 20 golden pets. That is actually going to be very easy. Quickly click nine and then um, 20. Wait, hold up. Okay, I, I think that should work, right? Yes, it worked. Okay, I just had to do breakables now, but I am going to hatch here too so we can get much better pets. Also, thanks to the developers, they did give me a lot more exclusive eggs, which has a new Titanic ghost face cat. And this thing, bro, it looks so cool. Cool. I want it badly. Here we go. Let me go ahead and set a keybind for this thing. Let's go ahead and make it a V, I guess. Why not? Here we go. Let's hatch eight of these eggs. Come on, bro. Give me something good. Yo, they look so cool, dude. Okay. Come on. Please. Yes. Oh, my God. Please, bro. Be the first Titanic I get in literally forever. But, no, that's a huge. Okay. That is definitely a huge. And it's a huge slasher sloth. Bro, it looks so cute. But it also looks so weird at the same time. Here we go, though. Area three. And I, I thought I could buy that next area for a second. There is these paths on the side of the map. Can I not go there? It looks like something you'd actually be able to go through. But there is this Halloween upgrades where you can spend your candy coins. And oh my god, I have 4 million. Let's go and buy some stuff. Um, You know, let's get some huge chance. That's good. Okay, that gets expensive pretty fast. More candy corn. We do need this for our uh, Halloween quest. So let's max that out. Um, more candy, why not? Wait, why is he so cheap to max out, bro? Hold up. Wait, giant pumpkin loot. Looks like they've added giant pumpkins. Giant pumpkins will spawn around the map, yielding a ton of candy. And they are pretty rare, so good luck finding one. And this is what he looks like. It's just like the old ones, obviously. But here we go. Let's just finish all of it because I can afford most of this stuff. There's some I can't, but, I mean, it, it's pretty cheap. I want to also go ahead and make sure I have, like, all of the potions activated that I need to have. Because these will probably help us out a ton. And, obviously, let's make sure we're eating our fruits, bro. Wait, bro, I can almost unlock the booth already. Had to 1,000 cauldron eggs. Where is that? Okay, I'll worry about that in a second. But we need to go through these areas. My next quest is make three rainbow pets. There we go. Boom, I have completed it. And now... Now we need to do breakables. I do have more coins, though, to go ahead and max this out. Bro, that was so easy to complete. What? I do not think the developers calculated how easy they made this to complete. But, um, yeah, we are done with that. As you saw earlier, though, we did get this new thing called the candy coins right here. I actually have 120 of them. Now, these can actually be used to combine into candy corn gifts using the candy corn machine, which we almost have unlocked. But here we go. Area 4, bro. Is this where that machine is? Yes, it is. It is right here. Let's hatch a little bit of this egg real quick, though. And they do have a new pet here, bro. Another huge skeleton pet. And it's a cat this time, bro. Instead of the huge skeleton. I think it was just called a huge skeleton before. Like, I'm talking about the dig site one. And now they have a cat for it. So it's pretty cool. 
But here it is. And with this, I can... Every 10 candy corn that I have, I can make a candy corn gift. Which is OP, bro. Because I feel like you can make so many of these. And it has a huge pet in it. So we should be able to get a lot of huges. The only thing I will say, though, it does look like it has a little bit of a price when it comes to gems. But it should be fine. But I'm going to go ahead and hatch this egg. Get a little bit better pets. And then hopefully by that time, I will be able to go to the last area. I do want to test out this forever pack because there is back rooms inside of this new update and we're almost at it so let's go ahead and purchase a little bit of the forever pack 50 robux okay we get 10 haunted or 5 haunted back room keys 25 crystal keys damage potions oh my god that's trash we get cocktails bro i would appreciate if you gave me this inside of pets go bro but here we go treasure hunter this is so trash bro Come on, man. Give me some of the new pets. I don't want this stuff. I want the new stuff. And oh my god, we got it. A golden huge gold horse, bro. Only two of these exist. Let's go. That is actually amazing. I am so glad we got something, bro. And it's pretty cheap. 250 Robux. It's not bad. I don't recommend any of you guys do it, though. Because I'm telling you, bro. Forever Pack is a scam. And oh my god, what just happened? But here we go. Area 5. Let's unlock it. And oh my god, I forgot my huge is hatching. Wait, let's get this. There it is, bro. The golden huge gold horse. That actually looks so nice. I love the gold horse pet. Fun fact, when the first Halloween event in Pets MX happened, uh, Roblox went down for a few days and it never came back up. Or, well, it did come back up, but in a, after a few days. There is this Trick or Treat Countdown 2 for next week. So, if you guys are here in this video next week, bro, there's going to be a massive update, apparently. I'm assuming that is for an actual Titanic pet being added for free-to-play players. I will provide more information for that later on. But let's hatch this pet, bro, because there is a huge pet that you can get from here that, um, well, you have to get lucky enough to hatch, first of all. And my luck is trash, so I'm not going to be hatching it. But if I scroll down all the way to the bottom right here in the bundles, there is a brand new pay to win enchant. And just so you don't have to waste Robux on it, I'm going to go ahead and buy it. And this will add one rare active huge to hatch as well as increasing my active huge hatch luck. So as you can see, there is currently three huges normally. And with this game pass, you can actually hatch four. So... Uh, let's go ahead and try it. I don't know if I can actually stack this because that would kind of be insane. But there it is. We got the active huge overlord. Um, this is a book, right? Looking at it over here, there is only three. So let me go ahead and equip this thing and test it out. All right, huge hunter. Let's unequip you. Active huge. And um, it's still the same thing. Hello? This is also set to be fairly good because apparently it increases your active huge hatch luck by 40%. But uh, I'll be the judge of that. And yeah, it's not popping up the fourth one over there like it's supposed to. I don't know. Maybe I can ask for huges, but uh, there's no way for me to tell right now. And it is kind of pointless during events. So I do not recommend you buy it if you're just going to be playing the event. But here we go, bro. Let's hop into the haunted back rooms. Let's see what it has to offer. And oh my God, this is just like the old back rooms, dude. Pumpkin machine make pumpkin gifts. Okay, so now there's even another currency in here Bro, there is so much in this update, but here we go Let's have some better pets here because I think this is an event inside of an event, bro Yeah, back rooms pets do more damage So we do obviously want to get it and we can explore for better eggs Well, let's go ahead and get on the hunt for this, bro Because we got things to find and let's see do these give anything good. Yeah, they don't Oh, this is a pretty cool little like potion room, bro. Okay. Where's the witch at? Wait, what is this? Did I just find a door, bro? Oh my god, wait. Hold up. Um, why can I not open this? Oh my god, it's another puzzle room, bro. What is this? There's like random letters on these books, bro. What am I looking for? Bro, they're acting like I'm Einstein, bro. I don't know how this works. A D L R. What am I supposed to do with this? Click it? I don't know. Maybe I need to like click the letters that I see here. So we have T P. E and then like I S M. Let's try that. So T right there. Oh, wait, you do click it. Okay, where is P, bro? Where is it at? Oh, here it is. Okay, T P. Here is E. 
I, and then we need an S and an M, bro. Where is the S and the M? Okay, I found the S, and then the M it should be really close, bro. Oh, there it is. All right, boom, M. There, I clicked it all. Bro, it did not work, man. Am I supposed to hit this in, a, like, a certain order? Maybe P-I-S-M, just that? Wait, I think this says Pet Sim. Unless I'm stupid, this is literally saying Pet Sim. Bro, okay, I think I did it wrong. So, P-E, and then we need to just say Pet Sim, I guess. Okay, yes, it is, bro, because it's all turning green this time. There we go. And then I need an I and an M. Where is the last two? Here is the I, and where's the M? There we go, M, done. Yes, I'm so smart, bro. They call me Einstein for some reason. Yeah, they definitely do not call me Einstein, bro. All right, we just need to choose a path. I have no idea where I'm going, why some of these pillars are, like, wooden. Okay, we just looped around, bro. Let's try going this way, maybe, instead. Nah, bro, I am not doing this room again, man. No way. No, but I am finding another route. Okay, uh, turns out there was no other route. I'm back. There we go. I have done it once again. I'm such a genius. Can I hatch my exclusive eggs in here? Bro, yes, I can. Oh, my God. Okay, before we continue to hatch these guys and... Okay, we got nothing. Maybe the strat is not to hatch them in here. We'll hatch them whenever we go back outside. But what I'm trying to find here is the secret room because we do have keys to unlock them. Oh, there's new breakables over here. Well, let's go ahead and set our pets over here, I guess, because it's probably a lot better. Yes, I found one, bro. Let's go, dude. Here we go, bro. Let's unlock it. And we got a 50 times huge chance for that thing. I have no idea what it's called. Wait, is this limited time? Oh, no. Can I stay in here forever, dude? Because there's no actual like countdown inside of here. Yeah, look, if I step away from it, it just says, oh, wait, never mind. There is a countdown. It is literally inside of his head. Bro, this is how I imagine Preston looking in real life, bro. This gotta be him. But you already know my luck sucks with this thing, bro. So there's no point in wasting my time there. Bro, I just teleported through the spawn room when I clicked the what just happened. But let's see if I've gotten any pumpkins. Because it did not, like, give me a notification. And I have. Look, bro, I almost got 30 of them. And I think with this, yes, I can make a different type of pumpkin egg. And this one actually just gives you the reward that is inside of this event. So let's go ahead and make just two of them for now. I think the other one that you can get at spawn is definitely a lot easier. It's definitely a nice feature, though, that the developers have introduced two events inside of one. And with that, like, you are you get to kind of, like, choose what you want to grind for. You're not forced to sit on only one thing. But I do want to go ahead and finish my Halloween quest. So, let's go ahead and hatch the cauldron egg in a second. Let's firstly break this guy over here. And, oh, it gives us candy corn. But I'm going to go ahead and finish this quest real quick. It'll take, like, two seconds for you guys. But, uh, I'll be back. There we go. I have finished the first quest. So, that means I did just get the booth. I have no idea what it's actually called, though. I think it's called, like, a vampire booth or something. I, I still need to get the hoverboard. But, um, where is my booth, bruh? There is no way I cannot find this, bro. Is it, Oh, here it is. The haunted booth. It does look pretty cool. I'll check it out later. But now we need to break 15 giant pumpkins. Bro, what? Where am I supposed to find giant pumpkins right now, man? I'm not actually quite sure if they can only spawn inside of this area. I am pretty sure they're limited into the event. But like I said, they are very rare to find. So that one is going to take us quite a bit of time. However, what won't take us quite a bit of time is opening these exclusive eggs, bro. Come on. Give me the Titanic, please, bro. I have over 9,000 eggs hatched and I've only hatched one Titanic. I will be the happiest man in the world. And I am going to be giving away most of these guys. So definitely join my Discord server linked in the description. Um, I always give away like huges I get from here because I turn them into huge machines. And I give them away in the Discord. So definitely check it out. And oh my god, we're only getting slobs, bro. All right, here we go. I'm going to hit like 24 eggs at once. Boom. There we go. 24. Come on. Be a good 24. Nothing out the first day. And oh my god, literally nothing. Bro, my luck in this game is worse than my dad going for milk. Another eight eggs of literally nothingness. Come on, come on. Please, please, please. Yes, yes. Come on. We got something. I'm clicking it. Come on, grow. Okay, yes, yes. Come on. 
Yes! Oh, no, oh, it's a huge! I mean, I will take it. I cannot complain, but um, let's see. Is that even the better huge, or is that the worst one? Okay, so I've gotten this one two ice, and now we just need the machete dog and the ghost face titanic. All right, here we go, bro. This is a ton of eggs. Oh, we got nothing. Oh, my God. Let's try the forever pack a little bit, bro. Let's, let's click this 400 Robux button. Maybe it's a little lucky after this. Um, but 50 charm chisels, no cares, who cares? Oh, we get a lot of exclusive eggs here. Oh my god. All right, let's go ahead and buy this as well. I want to try to get the Darkwing Dominus, at least the huge version. And wait, isn't there already a huge in the game that was like hatchable? Bro, unless I'm tripping, there was like some sort of Dominus huge that you could hatch. I think the one I'm thinking of is the Shadow Dominus. Yeah, it was this one. My bad. I thought they were like the same thing for a second. But here we go, diamond potions, exclusive vouchers, nothing good. But, I mean, they're giving you a lot of exclusive eggs in this forever pack. Which is interesting because they're not giving me anything else. Oh my god, I see another huge bat, bro. The huge gold hordes, another one of them. This time it's a normal version, but I will go ahead and take it. You know, let's go ahead and take this one too. And I don't want to spend a lot of Robux on this. So here we go. Criticals, mini chest fortunes, treasure hunter, mini chest. And yeah, it, it's not worth it. I'm not buying this, bro. But come on, let's hatch eight exclusive eggs with this huge pet. Hopefully we can get two. And nope, it looks like this is going to be the huge that we get. There we go, bro. Another huge gold horse. Let's go. I also have so much candy corn, bro. So I can go ahead and make 76 of these candy corn gifts, which I will use in a second. But here we go. I'm going to go ahead and keep opening these eggs. And as you can see, I actually capped at a billion Halloween candy. It looks like that's the max. And, bro, I got nothing again. It is honestly a very low cap, bro. Because if you want to attach with a hypercharge and golden, it takes away 200 million every single time, bro. So that is a very expensive price to be hatching at. 16 more eggs, man. Please don't make me disappointed. Come on. Yes, okay. We got at least the one thing. I, I'm really hoping you're the other huge. Come on. Okay, that's definitely a huge, and it's another sloth, bro. All right, bro, here we go. Attempt 1 billion. I'm just going to hatch like 40 of them. I don't know. This is over 60, actually, but come on. One of them's got to be good, man. There is no way. Look, I just hatched all of that, and I got literally nothing. You're welcome. 18 more eggs. Come on, please. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm going to cry, bro. Wait, Angry is hatching exclusive eggs too. Hold up, bro. Let me hatch with you, man. Come on. Please don't tell me your luck's better than mine. And, okay, never mind. Your luck sucks. Let's try this candy corn gift, though, because I actually made a lot, bro. Surprisingly, it's very easy to make. Here we go. Let's try it out. Let's open eight and then 16 of them. I wonder if the luck is actually any good inside of this. Kind of like the dino gifts, because if you remember, the dino gifts, they were really good, bro. But um, I don't know if this is the same because it's a lot easier to make these than it was to getting dino gifts. So I am hoping it has actually good chances because then that would mean it's a very easy free to play huge. But I don't know because my luck is terrible. Uh, let me know. Comment down below if you guys do get this easily or um, if it's any good for you as well. Because I think this is definitely much better and there we go i'm hatching everything i have there's no more that i have so come on please give me some nice and yeah obviously we're not gonna get it with only 100 but i gotta say the developers definitely cooked with this update probably one of their better updates to end off the video though i do want to go ahead and hatch eight more of these exclusive eggs and in the next update we can expect a titanic pet to be coming in i will have a specific video for that but there we go eight eggs and we got nothing watch this video on the screen right here this is my favorite video i think you will love it hurry up click it this video is about to end until then have a great rest of your day bye